close. Fox News Flash Top Entertainment Headlines for September 15. Ozzy Osbourne is on the road to recovery after a 2019 fall left him with painful injuries. The rocker, 72, will soon undergo major surgery on his neck and back which will help alleviate a lot of his pain, his wife Sharon Osbourne told Daily Mail TV. As a result of the bathroom fall, Ozzy dislodged metal screws in his spine which were originally put in after he was in a quad bike accident in 2003. Sharon told the Daily Mail she hopes the Black Sabbath frontman will be able to get back on stage soon. That's what I pray for, she said. In 2019, the Osborne family spoke with Robin Roberts on Good Morning America about Ozzy's incident. When I had the fall, it was pitch black, he recalled. I went to the bathroom and I fell. I just fell and landed like a slam on the floor and I remember lying there thinking, well, you've done it now, really calm. Sharon, called, an ambulance. After that, the family also opened up about Ozzy's Parkinson's disease diagnosis. It's PRKN2, Sharon told GMA. There are so many different types of Parkinson's, it's not a death sentence by any stretch of the imagination, but it does affect certain nerves in your body. And it's, it's like you have a good day, a good day, and then a really bad. Parkinson's is a neurodegenerative disorder that typically develops slowly over years, although not all patients are affected the same. It can cause tremors, limb rigidity, gait and balance issues as well as slowness of movement. There is no known cure for the disease, but patients can seek treatment through various medications and surgery, according to the Parkinson's. Fast forward to 2021 and Sharon told the Daily Mail that Ozzy's Parkinson's is under control. It breaks your heart, Sharon told the outlet. He wants to get back, on the road. He misses his friends, his musicians. They're his partners. He misses that life. But with his Parkinson's, he's fine. He's fine. He's got it under. Elsewhere in the Daily Mail interview, the former talk co-host spoke candidly about her volatile relationship with Ozzy. The interview focused on an upcoming biopic that will explore the relationship between the media personality, 68, and the musician. Sharon and Ozzy first met when the TV host was just 18 years old. The couple was first introduced by Sharon's father, who managed Ozzy's band, Black Sabbath, at the time. Our fights were, legendary, Osborne told Daily Mail TV. We would beat the S.T. out of each other. It stopped, must be, 20 years ago, but we had a good run. Despite the tumultuous relationship the two shared, Sharon called the biopic a love story during the interview. It's a movie about Aussies and my life, how we came together in the early days and our volatile relationship, Sharon said. All the fights, all the makeups, all the fights, all the arrests, all the everything. And it's a love. People are going to watch it go, this isn't allowed. They shouldn't behave that way and put it on film, she added. But, we're, only talking the truth. Some people have volatile relationships and ours was very volatile.